hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Kelechi Legan Franklin and if it's your first time to join me this is a video I'm doing based on people who are demanding to know how to buy a uh, coin using the pancake swap some of the shit coins in which you see people post and they ask you to buy it or get it you can always get them on your pancake swap and you, it makes your work more easier so um let me say i'm looking for a particular coin for instance i'm looking for most token uh, most token your yeah, most token contract address just type on google most token contract address and you it will appear like this once it appears like this all you need to do okay all you need to do is to click on this blc when you see blc like this BSC it simply means Binance Smart Chain all you need to do is to click on it and when you click on it it will appear you will to not allow you or enable you to pick up the contract address so that you can go to your trust wallet and buy from pancake swap so I'm allowing it to load once it has load properly I will now have to pick up this contract address this is the contract address as you can see here all I have to do is to click here and copy it let me copy it to my keyboard and I've done that all I have to do right now is to move out from here and then go to my trust wallet so so another way in which you can be able to copy a contract address of a particular coin is to come to your coin jinko your coin jinko you can find it to your app your apple play store or your normal play store you can go to your ios and get your coin jinko when you go to your coin jinko you download you have to download the lead it can be able to enable you to copy different contract address of any coin you want all you have to do is to come to this search button down below here all you need to do is to come to the search button down below here you see the search button down here right now you just to click on your search button you click on the search button type the most token as you can see you type the most token swap as you can see it it will appear like this all you have to do is to go up here then move sorry you go up then move this cursor you will see where the road information as you can see information you click on this information once you click on this information guys <coughs> once you click on this information it will appear like this all you need to do is to click on this you click on this blockchain and supply then you click on this icon here it will take you directly to the same place in which you we went to google and we copy the contract address you can see it took us directly but one thing normally happens some of these coins you might not likely see them in coinjinko sometimes even they are not listed on coinjinko but you can find it easier in your google drive so if you don't find a particular coin which you are looking for in your coinjinko you can go to your google drive and then copy the contract address so as you can see i just copied the contact address the next thing i have to do is to go to my is to go to my trust wallet right now i'll go to my trust wallet first of all all i need to do is to add the coin is to add the coin to my wallet so that once i swap i will be able to see it i'll go to this up section and then click on it then paste the contract address that i copied i paste it as you can see i will just on it once i have on it i will now have to go to my dabs the dabs you go to click on the dabs look at the dabs down here then it will enable you to go to your pancake swap but before then before you go to your pancake swap it make sure that you have binance smart chain make sure you have bnb which is binance smart chain make sure you have it in your wallet make sure you have it on your wallet because any transaction you want to do on the pancake swap because the pancake swap is a binance smart chain transaction we have the uniswap and many other exchanges but once you go to the pancake swap all you need to do is to before you go to the pancake all you need to do is to make sure that you have a bnb on your wallet so once you click on the dabs it will appear like this you scroll down you scroll down you will see different exchanges so all you need to do is to click on the pancake swap we have the uniswap and 
further swap exchange but we are going to the binance smart chain which is the pancake swap i'll click on it once i click on it having in mind that my i have bnb on my wallet which is will enable me to do whatever transaction i want to do once it's a shit coin you can get it here on your pancake swap once you have come to this direction the next thing you need to do is to allow it to load as you can see you will see if it's your first time coming to this place or to this pancake swap you it will give you an opportunity to make sure that your to make sure that your your wallet is connected you see down here or you will look at this particular stuff and i'm showing you up here it will indicate to you that you should connect your wallet my wallet is already connected that is why it's not showing so the next thing i have to do right now is to do my transaction this is where my transaction happens this is where my transaction happens so in this transaction i'm going to do i want to swap a sheet coin with my bin uh, with my bnb this is my bnb at the top and the coin that i want to swap is down the same thing happens when you want to withdraw the money you also put the coin at the top and the one you want to do below so first of all you you have to the next thing you need to do is to look for the coin i want to look for the coin so i will paste the contract address i'll paste the contract address for the coin to show as you can see it has appeared so all i have to do is to click on it to add it as you can see I just clicked on it and it make that sound so if i want to buy with all the coin i can click on maximum if i want to still buy with a particular amount i can still just type the number of coin that i have but because of this tutorial i will just put the maximum and do the transaction i want to do so i'll click on swap so i'll click on swap Okay. Now I've clicked on swap. Now they are asking me to do some transaction. So the transaction is about to be approved. Okay. The transaction is about to. All I have to do is to approve the transaction, and voila, the, it has been accomplished. Okay. Okay. It has been done it twice so it has been done so all i have to do is to go back as you can see the transaction is about to be gone so i have to do is to go back to my wallet if i go back to my wallet i'll light for some time and as you can see it just appeared at the top which means it has gone so all i have to do is to, if i want to cross check to confirm again I can still go back to my pancake swap, look at it again, and that is it. So with this, you have been able to swap a coin. As you can see on my screen, it's a transaction has been accomplished. And I can see that on my wallet. So I can still come to check it back. I want to show you in case probably when you want to withdraw that same money in which you have purchased a particular coin, you want to withdraw it. All you have to do is to still come back to this your pancake swap, come to this place, also put in or type in the name of that coin and it will appear once it appears. Now I want to, assuming I want to withdraw the money, I will still do the same thing. All I have to do is to click on maximum, but this time, instead of my BNB to be at the top, my BNB is below and the coin I want to swap and this one is down. So, once i did like this i'll just do my click on my transaction on approve and i have been able to purchase the coin but for now i'll leave this the way it is and see when next i want to so that's that guys see you on my next video if it's your first time to join me on my channel please do where to subscribe and this is a new channel that i just opened not too long ago please support my channel by clicking on the like button and subscribing put on the top post notification button to in, it will go a long way in helping me to do more video please leave a comment at the comment section all you just need to do is to type pancake on the comment section it will let us create an algorithm that we do uh, videos like this in this channel god bless you see you on my next video